Right, just doing running repairs on uh, on a Tiger Cub 1961. As you can see, we've got the gearbox in bits there. Uh, the problem was excessive play in the clutch. Uh, it just happened all at once. And on uh, investigation, uh, we found what the problem was, and I'll show you here. Uh, the thrust washer in the gearbox seems to have departed. It's broken into three pieces, and obviously it was letting the shaft float about. Uh, therefore, we got to excessive clutch play. Anyway, I've ordered a new uh, thrust washer, which I should get tomorrow, and uh, we'll be sorting it out. In the meantime, I've been fitting indicators to this bike. Right, whilst riding this bike, I just feel as though I'd be a little bit safer if I had indicators on. As you can see, I've got these two indicators, well, four actually, one on each corner. Uh, and actually, they came and they, they match in silver and black. About £10 with the flasher unit, not too bad. Uh, what I did do was make a bracket, because I didn't want to spoil the bike, drill any holes in it or do anything wrong, so I've made a bracket which I fitted there and fitted to the original bolt uh, worked out very nice, it just pops under the seat and I put that on just to make it a bit tidier so we've got a little black thing there right and I used, uh, what I did use for wiring is cat cable, very low voltage uh, brought it under the seat, under the tank and it brought it to the nacelle at the front uh, but uh, combined switch, headlight, horn, everything uh, let's have a look. Made it very neat. Uh, took all the wiring underneath, as you can see, and then we've got the indicators. Uh, the front indicators, I made brackets for them and brought them to the, the bolts that uh, secure the downed tubes there uh, and just fastened them onto there. So, uh, basically, worked out very neat. Very pleased with it. Nice flashes. Nice and bright. Not too bad, quite pleased with those. Uh, also, I brought all the equipment down into the battery box, so we've got the flasher unit, let's have a look, the flasher unit, and uh, a fuse. Uh, just a little 3 amp fuse in there, just to protect it. Uh, and the big system, the main system, is uh, in, is also fused. Uh, the flashes are negative earth, and the bike is actually 12 volt positive. So what I've done, I've just brought everything back to the battery uh, and made its own loop round so it's negative earth for the indicators. Quite easy with the cable because there's eight strands in the cable. You can put two together if you want, which I have done, and then can route them all the way back and it just makes it a nice and neat and not wires all over the place. So there you have it. Hoping to get the bike to, back together over the weekend and have a ride out. Uh, Maybe Matlock if I'm lucky. Uh, we'll see how we go. Uh, engine is uh, just been rebuilt, 9 to 1 uh, compression, R cam. It's got a nice hammer on it, but I'm hoping to get a bigger one because the port's been opened out to 1 inch. So it goes quite well. So that's all we have today on the Tiger Cub with, would you believe it, indicators. Thank you.